ไทยรัฐเสกทีรัฐ number thirty six ปามปฏิพานกล้าหาญ Number 55, Nop a t h a p o n l a d Malay p o n Number 65, Big t i r w a t d a n t a s o n Number 69, Pam d u r o n g p a n a p i r o w i r a s h a i Number 77, Pe s h i t s h a i Ananti. And number 99, Bat Kung k a n a t s a m a n t a And the referee for this game, referee name, Mr. Yu s h a n g from Chinese Taipei. Umpire war, Mr. j a r a d i Haza from Indonesia. Umpire two, Mr. Wu s i from Singapore. And the commissioner, Mr. w i w a t i t a p a r a k u n ลำดับต่อไปขอเชิญทุกท่านในที่นี้ค่ะยืนตรงเพื่อเคารพเพลงชาติ Please stand for national anthem. ไปก็จะเป็นคู่ที่2ประจําวันนะครับของรายการเซียบาสแตนโกวิชครับปี2016ระหว่างทีมชาติไทยกับทีมชาติมาเลเซียต่อไปนี้เราก็จะมาดูความพร้อมของทั้ง2ทีมนะครับเริ่มต้นจากทีมชาติไทยก่อนโดยเราจะสัมภาษณ์กับโค้ชทีมลูอิสนะครับ so coach after watching Malaysia yesterday what do you think your team has to do and adjust in order to get improve your chances of winning here 
Yeah, I think the big thing for us is obviously competing on the offensive and defensive glass, uh, limiting their second chance opportunities. Um, I think we've got to do a really good job of keeping them, uh, you know, or, or winning the, the offensive rebounds and, uh, and the defensive boards today. And I think that puts us in a much better position. ครับหลังจากที่ถามนะครับว่าได้ดูมาเลเซียเมื่อวานแล้วมีอะไรต้องปรับปรุงก็คือโค้ชชิมบอกว่าต้องระวังเรื่องการรีบาวทั้งเกมรุกและเกมรับป้องกันไม่ให้เขาได้จังหวะยิงจังหวะ2นะครับก็นี่คือเบื้องหลังของทีมชาติไทยก่อนที่จะแข่งกับทีมชาติมาเลเซียนะครับเดี๋ยวเรามาดูเรื่องของทีมชาติมาเลเซียต่อครับก็เดี๋ยวเรามาดูเบื้องหลังของทีมชาติมาเลเซียนะครับกับความพร้อมสําหรับการแข่งครั้งนี้ก็เดี๋ยวเราจะสัมภาษณ์กับโค้ชโกนะครับ so coach Yes. After watching Thailand yesterday, what do you think your team needs to improve after the game against the Philippines? Well, from what I see, uh, I maybe Indonesian played badly yesterday, so we cannot really see the true strength of uh, the Thailand. So whatever is it, we have to face each other. We will try our best, and I think Thai Thailand teams would try their best too. I think this match will be an interesting game. Krab Lang. ความพร้อมของทีมชาติมาเลเซียนะครับหลังจากที่ได้เห็นฟอร์มของไทยเมื่อวานโค้ชโกก็บอกว่าไทยแข่งกับทีมอินโดนีเซียที่เล่นได้ไม่ค่อยดีเท่าไหร่เพราะฉะนั้นอาจจะวัดอะไรได้ยากจึงคิดว่าทั้ง2ทีมน่าจะเล่นกันเต็มที่โดยอาจจะไม่ได้มีอะไรต้องปรับปรุงกันมากแต่ก็โค้ชโกย้ําว่าเกมนี้น่าจะเป็นเกมที่สนุกมากครับเพราะฉะนั้นพลาดกันไม่ได้แล้วเดี๋ยวรอติดตามชมกับเกมระหว่างทีมชาติไทยกับทีมชาติมาเลเซียได้ในอีกสักครู่ครับSo we're about to start here. We're back with the Siawa Stankovic Cup 2016. The next game will be between Thailand, the host of the competition, going up against the Malaysian national team. Going back to yesterday, Thailand started off their campaign in the Siawa Stankovic Cup with a wonderful win over Indonesia, 89 to 44, while Malaysia on the wrong end of that of a, that side between the Philippines. 108 to 84. However, Malaysia impressed us quite a lot. Wouldn't you agree, Pete, that they played pretty well? It's just uh, the Philippines were just so much better. Oh, yeah. I mean, uh, Malaysia did, did well themselves, you know, but the Philippines just individually have a lot of skill and, uh, you know, played together as a team very well. A lot of credit to the coaching staff as well. You know, uh, this should be a really good match, TK. You know, I'm, I'm looking, really looking forward to this match right here. Yep, and Coach Tim Lewis sticking with his starting lineup. Nakorn Jai Sanuk, Chanat Chon Glahan, Tirwa Chantajon, Chitchai Ananti, and Kanat Samarjai. One thing that pops out about this Thailand national team right now, I, I'm loving their blue jerseys here. Really a uh, sight to see. Oh, yeah. It's a beautiful. That's, that's a lot of swag in that, TK. <laughs> I like that. And here's the tip off. Wong Yi Hao taps the ball out of bounds. Thailand will get the first possession in the game. The starters for Malaysia. Wong Yi Hao 
Juan Yung Jing Gan Hong Hung oh, Gan Hung Hong Hung Ma Chi Quen and Quek Tian Yuan Chichai Ananti has Gan on him and there's a foul it's an early call it seems like an unsportsmanlike foul referees are warning him early Chichai Ananti looks like he didn't mean it don't know if we're gonna get a slow replay of that but no harm done. Seems like a, it's going to be Thailand ball. And I think it's, it's a Samar Jai. Samar Jai drives down the court. Slices up the defense. Unable to finish that. But Samar Jai does have that skill to get all the way down into the lane. A steal by Thailand. Samar Jai pushing the pace. He has Malaysia backpedaling and a foul. Smart move by Samar Jai to you know, go up at him. Get the quick foul real quick, shoot some free throws. Let's, let's, let's see if he can make it. Yeah, not backing away despite being one of the smallest guys on the court. Just knows that he has to get aggressively to the basket. Nice anticipation by Samar Jai. He's going to shoot two free throws. The first one rolls out. Thailand unable to draw first blood. Here's the second shot by Samar Jai. Nothing but net. Drops the first point for the game. Summer Jai had eight points, three assists yesterday. Let's see if he can do some more damage. Machi Quen sets up for the three. He hit three yesterday against the Philippines. Doesn't hit his first one. Summer Jai passes up. Ananti was almost not ready, but lucky there. Ananti oh. gets the offensive foul called on him. Ananti picks up two quick fouls here. Let's see if Tim Lewis keeps it in the game or not. I'm not sure about the first call, what they called on him, but it's not on the scoreboard as a foul. Oh, yeah? Yeah, so that's one foul on Ananti. Okay. One offensive foul there. Ananti right. has got to watch about going wild, though. Yeah, definitely. Thailand fans packing the stadiums, cheering their national team on. Wang Yi Hao impressed us yesterday with 22 points. Getting smothered by Ananti there. Good defense by Ananti. Good defense by Thailand as a whole there, but... Oh, tough shot. Malaysia gets the better of them. Quick, Tian Yuan smothered with foul trouble yesterday against the Philippines. Fouled out with only 13 minutes. Gets on the board for Malaysia. First two points, it's 2-1. to one. Nakar Jai Sanuk. Splash for Thailand. Nakar Jai Sanuk has been on fire in this competition. That's his fourth three since day one. See if he can keep it out throughout the whole week. Gan Malaysia tries, tries to answer. answer. No good. <laughs> Unable to do that. But Kwan Yung Jing hustling. Doesn't get the end of it. Summer Jai. Nice pass up to Chana Chon. Another aggressive try at the basket and draws another foul. And that's a fantastic pass to pass it up and push forward the ball to get that foul right there. And that's a crucial foul on Machi Quen as well. One of Malaysia's lead guards. That's his second. Ghana Summer Jai doing a really good job fording the ball to his teammates and putting him in the right position to get the points or the foul. Thailand and coach Tim Lewis doing their scouting reports right. Uh, Malaysia had plenty of foul trouble yesterday. 30 fouls in the game against the Philippines. And they put Machi Quinn in foul trouble too early here. Unable to drop the free throws though. Malaysia answers quick. Air Nothing balls. But air. <laughs> A little too quick of a shot there, TK. Yeah, didn't get the offensive rolling yet. The ball barely moved. Malaysia going full court. Full court press here. But Thailand breaks it down. Tirawat going outside. Quick move by Singh. And he passes it out. A turnover by Thailand. One of that's, the and that's not one of his strengths from yeah. Glahan. <laughs> It's not, it's not one of his strengths, passing. So, you know, what Thailand's got to do right now is put the ball in the right passer and go from there. That's true. Here we see Malaysia. They do not have an actual true point guard. They're running a lot of their offense through Quan, Quan Yung Jing. And the foul after the shot, too. I don't know if that's going to be called a possession or if he's going to shoot one more free throw.
So yeah. actually, Malaysia is going to get the possession after two points as well. Well, uh, of, well of course, DK. You know, they're uh, gonna, what? you can't foul and, you know, and, and, and get the ball back. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> That's true. So two points down, and Malaysia gets possession. Shana Chun Glahan with his first foul. Chai Nanti has got to watch out about that intensity. He's guarding Wang Yi Hao. Nice strip away by Chichai Ananti. Kanatsu Murjai pushing it, gets to Ananti. Little bit too powerful on the layup. Out of control <laughs> there, and luckily they get the ball back. Oh, loses again. The ball just going cross sides. Thailand, as we were about to mention, Indonesia forced 20 turnovers out of them despite that win. And there's another foul. Nice move by Wang Yi Hao. Gets Nakor Jaisenok to commit to the fake shot. I really like this kid, TK. You know, he's he's got the killer look in his eyes. If you see from the first uh, foul that uh, Chichai Nanti did, he looked at him like, hmm, you're not getting that again. <laughs> Just a sweet move by Wang Yi Hao to get that foul on Nakor. He's going to shoot two. As you mentioned earlier, Yi Hao scored 22 points on the Philippines. Thailand has to calm down a little bit here. That's true. You don't want to get into a running game against Malaysia. They're a pretty good running team as well. Earlier you saw uh, Kalaha, number 13, uh, playing really close defense on the team captain of Malaysia. And that's, in my eyes, that's a mistake. Knowing that, uh, as you see, Tiarot with a nice spin. <laughs> that's your boy, Pete. Yeah, that's my boy right there. <laughs> I like him. Big spin move by the big boy. You know, see, you see Glahan here really close. He's going to get blown by. He needs to back up. And he doesn't need to stay there. Exactly. He doesn't have the three-point shot. But he's not the quickest guy on his feet. <laughs> so he's got to back up and play defense accordingly. No sure. need to foul. And no need to be all up past the three-point line. Thailand moving the ball well. That one ends up with Malaysia, though. Hey, you know, I like the aggressiveness that Thailand's giving the ball to this big boy right here. That's what they need to do. They need to go inside and exploit this mismatch right there. They got no answer for that big boy. Good point, Pete. Tirawat Chantaj on a lot of mismatches. On the defensive end, he's taking Kwek Tian Yuan. Here's Yi Hao takes another three. That's his second, but he misses it this time again. That's good defense by Nancy with the long go-go gadget arms. China, they're a pretty underrated defender. I feel like not a lot of people are giving enough credit, but and I think uh, Chichai Nanti has a finger injury yeah, right he's now. Yeah, seems a little bit down there, sitting down on the floor. And Akorn Jackson Hook trying to break down the defense. Looks for his options there. Nice pass to Glahan. Glahan can't finish. Passes it out. Samurai off balance, can't hit. Malaysia gets the rebound, and they need to. Uh to look to get the ball inside to Tirawat early. That way it draws attention. Quan Yung Jing goes inside again. That's his second drive and he makes the basket as well. Malaysia in the lead, seven to six. Almost halfway through the first quarter. We have a well contested game here. Jai Sanook for three. Splash. Jai Sanook is on fire. It's nine to seven, his second. Three-pointer in the game. And that's another guy, a big factor for the Thai national team. They need to get him open to get more shots. They need to get him going. He needs those touches. And there's a foul on Glahan. Quick Tian Yuan goes down to the floor. Glahan is called for his second foul. Let's see the replays here. Glahan going full into him. Quick looking in disbelief <laughs> at what happened. Or he's trying to catch his breath. <laughs> <laughs> so coach Tim Lewis is going to substitute in Ataporn Lert Malayporn and Patipan Glahan bringing out Ananti and Chanachon. Teo number 17 passes the ball quick. There's a foul call on Glahan. It's a pretty touchy foul but Thailand in foul trouble. Should be their fifth foul. Team foul putting quick to the line. And not a smart foul for Thailand. No need to, to foul early like that's, this. That's true. Now they're going to have to play defense with, with a lot of carefulness. Five minutes left in the first quarter, and they're already in the team penalty. This is a thing they have to practice, especially if they want to compete with the Philippines. 
You're going to have to play solid ball without fouling. Yes, sir. Quick Tin Yuan makes the first free throw. It is 9-8. On the floor earlier, Malaysia substituted in number one, Ong. That's a part learn my life horn with a lane. Goes inside, tries to draw a foul, but instead drops in the reverse layup. Thailand goes up again, 11-8. One thing about Thai basketball players, they look like they're doing Muay Thai while they're playing. <laughs> maybe so, it's in their blood. <laughs> yeah, maybe. We, we all have a little bit of that in ourselves. <laughs> so the one thing I get the advice that I give to other teams is be careful. <laughs> get out the way or take a charge. <laughs> but the charge might hurt a bit. <laughs> and it's, it's actually, uh, as you watch the replay here. Nice tap out by Tirawat. Timeout called. Coaches still trying to figure each other out. As Coach Go Cheng Hwat uh, interviewed with us before the game, he said that Thailand going up Indonesia, they aren't able to tell much from that. So Indonesia wasn't really well prepared. So not much to take out of that game. Coach Go said he wants to feel them out here in the first quarter and work out from there. Coach Tim Lewis, however, mentioned about the offensive and defensive board. They've got to handle that. They've got to stop Malaysia from getting those second chance points. And they haven't been doing, they've been doing pretty well, but they've let one offensive rebound go away. Got to watch out more for that. However, Malaysia is a really, really long team. Quick team, you in arms that go forever. Kwan Yung Jing, long, long guy. Inside players of Thailand have got to take him out. We have a pretty packed stadium here at Stadium 29 in Bangkok, Thailand, the venue of the fifth Siva Stankovic Cup. We have five teams here in contention Thailand, Malaysia, Indonesia, Singapore, and Philippines fighting out for the top two spots to qualify for the FIBA Asia Challenge. Quick Tin Yuan, two free throws coming up. Quack calmly sinks down his first free throw. The score is 9 to 11. And he drops them both. Malaysia putting a full court press. Ghana Samurai breaks it easily. Passes it to Nakorn. Can he hit? Doesn't go for his third straight, but nice offensive rebounding there by Thailand. Nakorn again. Woo! Splash! That man is on fire. Let's Three three-pointers already. Let's see if Malaysia can answer. Malaysia going a bit slow. Ong, Ong hesitates, but misses out. There's a hold there, and it's it's on. It's on Patipan Glahan, who's also with his second foul. So the Glahans, once again, unrelated. Both with two fouls, Thailand in foul trouble. Ivan Yo, who's just made his way onto the floor, number 41 of Malaysia, is going to take two free throws. Ivan Yo misses the front end. Ivan Yo, yesterday with a huge rebounding game, nine rebounds, four points. Gets on the scoreboard here, pushes the lead of Thailand down to only three. It's 14 to 11. Four minutes, 27 seconds left. Suk Dave Gogar making his way onto the court. Samurjai instantly feeds him at the top of the post. Nice defense there by Ong, but too aggressive and they get a foul. This can be the fourth team foul on Malaysia. Both teams nearing the penalty, a lot of aggressive play. What do you think so far, Pete? Hey, aggressive is good. I want to see a hard, hard played game. Summer Jive getting guarded by Ong. Drives to the lane. Almost drops it down. Draws a foul first. That should be Ong second. And just having trouble guarding Summer Jai here. Summer Jai being very aggressive for Thailand here. Giving a lot of problems for them. First free throw rolls out. Samurjai has to work on that a bit. 
Number Jai made one of two in his first trip. And goes one of two in his second trip. Two points for Samurai Jai, along with two rebounds and one assist so far. Sektira, your boy again, beat into the game. Playing yep. on the wing. Tira Wat guarding out far to Quick Tin Yuan. Ong. Ong breaks down. Gets stripped by Samurai Jai on the fast break. Tries a little bit of a fancy pass and turns the ball over. Tight game situation like this. Fancy passes might cost you. Ong gets Ivan Yo. Hits the mid-range jumper. Good shot. Ivan Yo. Getting, 41. Yeah, getting the ball right into the rhythm. No hesitation. Knows his spots. And hits the jumper. Malaysia down by two. 15 to 13. Three minutes left. At the point. Tries to drive. Gets it to six. Hero goes. Feeds. Tiro Watt. Can't get the bank, but he gets the rebound somehow. Quick Tian Yuan unable to handle that. And Tiro Watt gets his second basket of the game. Thailand up 17 to 13. It is well contested here. Teams are trading punches. Quick Tian Yuan in the post. Tries to blow by, and a foul is called on Tirawat first. It looked like a walk right there. Yeah, a lot, but probably got a little bit handled on the arms there by Tirawat Chanta John. Coach Tim Lewis has got to worry about the foul troubles here. But that's what he's doing. He's going deep into his bench. Bandit Lakhan substituting in Kanat Samurjai. Kekten Yun going to the line once again. Hits the first one. Pretty good shooter. Nice touch. Quack didn't play much yesterday, but he got eight points in only 13 minutes. Misses the second free throw. 17 to 14. Two minutes, 50 seconds left. Tirawat outside. Screens for Lakhan. Ataporn gets fouled. And they're going to go to the line. This is going to be a pretty slow-paced game, Pete. Well, like I said, you know, you got to get out the way or you're getting hit. <laughs> Teams are just going aggressive at each other. Especially if you know this player right here, Atapon. He is not backing down. He's going to go <laughs> straight through you. Veteran player knows how to get to the lane. He's physical. Yep. Knows what to do once he gets that contact, how to sell it. Able to drop one free throw. 14 to 18. Thailand not doing so well, only shooting three of eight from the line. Malaysia, on the other hand, going six of nine. That could be the separation that caused trouble late in the game. Ong oh, trying to break down Bandit. Tries a pass. And gets tipped away by Jerome Han Apiromi Laichai, who has just made his way onto the floor. Coach Tim Lewis going deep into his bench. It's only the first quarter. There's three minutes left. Malaysia gets quick in the corner. Almost a steal there. Ivan Yo tries to rip his way. Shot clock running down. Four seconds. Wang Yi Hao gets blocked. Nice defense by Thailand. Forces the shot clock violation, just swarming Wang Yi Hao. Hey, a lot of credit to this kid, Wang Yi Hao, man. He's got tons of skill. And also more credit to Ty Nashville and took for recognizing it just now and double teaming him. Yep. Seems like they've done their scouting reports well. They know that he's going to shot fake. Just don't commit to it. The wrong behind making his way. Bandit Lakhan with a nice swing pass to Sektira wide open. Doesn't hit the three point shot. And Malaysia is going to get the ball back. Almost a turnover there by Quick. Fancy pass. Yi Hao puts it on the floor. Goes. Drops. Strong take. Wong Yi Hao. Keeps on impressing and proves that yesterday's performance against the Philippines wasn't a fluke. Two points for the kid. And a traveling violation there by Derong Pan. Too quick on his feet. Didn't dribble the ball first. <laughs> thought about that movement too early. So with one minute 41 seconds left, Thailand in the lead by two, 18 to 16. Teams are staying together. No one's breaking away yet. 
Ivan Yo gets the ball on the baseline, kicks it out to Quack Tian Yuan, who has that shot in his arsenal. Doesn't hit that time. Nice warming rebound by Thailand. They're on the run. That was a pretty risky swipe. Sukdev Gogar, unselfish pass to the Rohan, draws a foul. And it's on. That seems to be, didn't get a good view of that. Let's see that again. Seems to be on number three, Chi Yi Leo. The wrong pun getting to the line. Wrong pun's a physical player, knows how to get to the line, shoots with efficiency, and he can make those free throws. Great defender. Great defender, as you always mention. <laughs> We're gonna see on the other end of that soon after this free throw. Two down, 20 to 16, Thailand in the lead. One minute, 10 seconds left at, in the first quarter between Malaysia and Thailand. Chiwi Lel. Looking for his options, gets one look at that defense by Thailand. Just look at that defense by Thailand, forcing the ball out of Kwan Yung Jing. Great team effort there by Thailand. Amazing. Bandit Lakhan gets it to Suk Dave Gogar. The wrong pun fakes Ataporn drives. Nice defense by Malaysia gets the block on Ataporn Lerma Lai Pon. Leo. Goes not tries to drop it out to Gan, but not communicated well with the turnover. 41 seconds, Thailand gets the ball. And you know, Thailand's doing a really good job not fouling, TK. Yeah, after they got in the foul trouble, it seems like they calmed down, settled down, put their hands in the right place, moved their feet, and just in the right position. And a foul on Quan Yung Jing. So it seems like Malaysia is on the bad end of the foul trouble now. Kwan Yung Jing will pick up his first personal foul on Pirate Sektira. Sektira going to the line for two. Sektira had eight points, went three for four from the free throw line yesterday. Continues well with his first free throw. Hits the second free throw. Thailand up 22 to 16. 32 seconds left in the first quarter. Can Malaysia put another point to stop this run? Ivan Yo tries to juke Ataporn out of position. Nice move. Creates the space and Ivan Yo drops another jump shot. He's looking much more confident in this game than he did yesterday. Getting off to a good start. 10 seconds left in the first quarter and Thailand is able to draw another foul, and it's on Ong Wei Young. Slow-paced game here. Bandit Lakhan gonna go to the line for two. Really, really good free throw shooter. I hope I didn't jinx him right now. <laughs> <laughs> and he proves me right. Hits his first free throw. We'll be taking another one with eight. 0.9 seconds left in the first quarter. Thailand starting out pretty well. It's them both. It's 24 to 18. Malaysia is going to have the last say in this quarter. Nice drive. Chi misses the shot. And the time expires before Ivan Yo. That is clearly not on time. Thailand is going to take the lead heading into the second quarter. It's 24 to 18. Pete, what is your take on this uh, first quarter of the game? Well, let me say this. Thailand is playing harder. I'll tell you right now. And, uh, and Thailand's more physical. So usually when the, the team that plays harder and is more physical is usually going to get the better outcome right now. So, but you know what? I, I believe in Malaysia from the kind of game they had yesterday against such a, a strong team. So I'm looking for them to come back and, and even it out, DK. Yes, sir. The defining moment, I feel, for for Thailand in that first quarter was that position where they swarmed Kwan Yung Jing down in the post. Four players just swarming, defending, raising their hands up and making life hard for them. They got the turnover out of that. And if they can keep that up, it's going to be a hard day for Malaysia. On the other end, Malaysia has been do did well in the first half of the first quarter to force fouls out of Thailand. If they can continue to do that later in the game, 
it's going to be a pretty well contested match throughout the whole 30 minutes of regulation left. Going to take a short break before we return to the second quarter. So we're about to resume action in the second quarter. This is the fifth Siaba Stankovic Cup 2016 held here in Bangkok, Thailand. The venue is Stadium 29. The game is between Thailand and Malaysia. Thailand in the lead 24 to 18. Doing a good job of playing aggressive defense and making their shots. Nagorn Jai Sanuk, the hero of this first quarter. Hitting three three-pointers, leading the way with nine points. In the court for Thailand, Zubdev Gogar, Darong Panapi, Romi Lai Chai, Pirat Sektira, Bandit Lakhan, and Ataporn Lert Malaiporn. For Malaysia, number one, Ong, Kwan Yung Jing, Gan Hong Hung. And that's an obvious deep offensive foul. Dropped his shoulder in a little bit too deep. And that's really great <laughs> reading by... Uh I pretty on Murai Chai to see that coming and selling it as well. See the replay here and just throwing his arm off a little bit too blatantly. Also in the court for Malaysia is Wang Yi Hao and Quick Tian Yuan. Sukhdev Gogar gets a touch. Gets it out to the Rongpan. Gogar is going to get it down in the post. Let's see if he works. Kwan Jing Jing, nice spin move. A foul oh. first. We've seen Wang that. Jing got lucky there. <laughs> yeah. We've seen that spin move a lot of times from Luke Dave Gogar. One of his signature moves right there. Kwan Yung Jing got lucky to not be uh, to be able to stop before scoring, but that will be his second personal foul. Sektira drives. Able to pass it to Lakhan. Lakhan with a side move. This is an open lane, just freezes the defense, gets the way, and a layup. Lead is eight now for Thailand. It's 26 to 18. Gan unable to open up the offense. Nice hustle by Darong Pan. Diving to the floor and gets the ball there. What a steal. What a defensive effort by the entire Thailand team here. Darong Pan kicks it out to Sektira. Turn over there, and a foul reach in by Sektira. And you know, uh, with the good penetration and defense that uh, number 69 for Thailand has right now, I think they need to put Jai Sanuk back in to be a wing shooter. That's true. Right now, <laughs> uh, Jai Sanuk is a streaky shooter, if I'm going to be straight about it. And just leaving him on the bench too long, it might be yeah. hard to get him come back and yeah, start firing up again. Yeah, he's had a good start. You know, you got to feed the hot hand. Yep. Gan Hong Hoong trying to break it down. Almost gets the ball. Thailand is going to get possession. The refs call it. Malaysia deflects the ball out. Sektira is going to be substituted. We're going to see Chichai Ananti coming back in. The wrong pun. Looking, he has Wang Yi Hao on him. Passes it to Lerd Malai Parn. Gets inside. Tries to get the defender to commit. Lakhan dribbles it down. Gets wide open. Lerd Malai Porn. Still gets his offensive rebound. Thailand just working hard. Finally, Malaysia gets the ball with a wide lane. Yi Hao, nice step. Unable to drop it down. And there's a foul. It's on Suk Dave Gogar. Drops Kwan Yung Jing to the floor. Suk Dave 
Not believing it. So out of that, Malaysia will get the inbounds. Gets it to Wang Yihao, fakes a shot, step back, tries to do it again, but Thailand getting more discipline. Ataporn goes. But just look at that hustle. And Ataporn frustrated, goes straight at Kwek Tien Yuen there. He's got to watch out. Lucky he got a warning there. Just a warning. <laughs> I want to see if Coach Tim handles something about it. Ataporn. Saying to his teammates that number 55 went at him first. <laughs> still complaining it on the bench. But still at, at this level, you're up by 10. You don't want to disrupt that, that flow. As we see here, Terwa trying to draw with some nice moves in the post. Four points from him in the first quarter. Yet to see him return back to the game yet. Coach Tim Lewis has created a defensively sound team and I got to talk with Coach Tim before he even got to try out with his players. His focus was to be the best defensive team in the Siaba Sankovic Cup. And while we are not actually completely there yet, we've seen the system and it's really working out well, Pete. What do you say about the, the Thailand defense so far in the past two games? Well, I would like to compliment Coach Lewis. You know, I, I believe what I've seen so far, Thailand might be the best defensive team in this tournament so far uh you know uh, without saying uh philippines got you know good individual defense but thailand swarming defense is is unbelievable right now i, I haven't seen anything like this in thailand before <laughs> that's true coach tim lewis said he wanted to bring a new experience for the fans of thailand to see their national team play and that's what we're seeing suk dave gogar confronting the refs a little bit Checking out what his fouls were about. On the floor is Lakhan, Gogar, Apiromi Lai Chai, Lert Malai Porn, and Anante. Surprisingly, we're seeing Coach Tim Lewis leave Ataporn, Lert Malai Porn in the floor. Hope he doesn't get anything in it. Heated there. Quack Tian Yuan with a nice move. Nice defense by Thailand once again. Does not commit the foul. And there's the foul by Wang Yi Hao. How it picks up his second foul, but once again, that defense by Thailand just hands up straight, contesting the shots, not invading that vertical plane of the Malaysia offense. Just solid, solid defense. And what I saw from Coach Lewis there just now, TK, is like he told Ananti to, to grab the ball first, then go. That's nice. Ananti doesn't get the layup there. Here's Gan. Trying to fake his way. Blocked by Ananti. Those long go-go gadget arms. Gets one block into the stat sheet. <laughs> Coach Tim Lewis saying to Ananti right there, why didn't you dunk it on the other side just now? <laughs> just go up for the jam. Machi Quen back on the floor. Three fouls already for the point guard. Gan Hong Hoong has Anandi on him. Quan Yung Jing misses the three. Hiromi Lai Chai passes it to Anandi. Good thinking to slow it down by Chichai Anandi there. Just calm down right now. Thailand in the lead, 28 to 18. Anandi with the corner three. Thailand just doing everything right here. Anandi adds three more to the lead. It is 31 to 18. Malaysia unable to score and and a foul there first by Derong Panabi Romi Lai Chai just almost able to get the ball there. <laughs> Probably tried to go for the player too much. And that's good defense by Api Romi Lai Chai right there. Almost gets the steal. Almost, just barely. Quick kicks it to Gan. Gan trying a hard pass to Quick, Quick, but a foul is called on Sukdev Gogar. Saved by the whistle. Sukdev Gogar might have been a little bit too forward. 
still nothing. You know, and give credit to the refs there, TK. <laughs> that, all of these calls are tough calls for these refs. Yeah, that was pretty close. Sudev Gogar leaned in a little bit too much for the refs' liking. And Sudev Gogar is going to sit down, bringing back in Shanachon Glahan. I think Coach Lewis likes the the muscle factor of Glahan. You know, he's really strong. Yep. And he can be a bruiser sometimes, get into the heads of the opponent. That's what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> Malaysia putting in a full court press. Bandit Lakhan. Oh, they break it down easily. And a foul on Quick Tin Yuan. Quick, that will be his first personal foul of the game. Good for him to keep those fouls on the low. Just needed to keep his feet a little bit more steady. Yeah, see Malaysia going into the to the press now. But Thailand's very active and very mobile in all positions, so they got it. They got to be careful in that press. And if they have this press in there now, you know. I'd like to see my boy Tiro Wat go back in. <laughs> yeah, he's been sitting on the bench a long time along with Nakorn Chai Sanok. Surprisingly. Bandit Lakhan getting substituted, bringing in Kana Samurjai. Both teams with four fouls already in the first, in the second quarter. Third Malai Porn hits his first free throw. And drops them both. Lead goes up 33 to 20. Malaysia has got to find more ways to counter this Thailand defense. Six minutes, 33 seconds left in the first half. On the floor, Samar Jai, Glaha, Apiromilai Chai, Ananti, and Lerd Malai Porn. Number live horn guarding. Nice pass. Ivan Yo tries to fake it out. Looked a little bit hesitant there to go straight up. Summer Jai breaks down the press. She has Maji Quinn on the back of his heels. Gets Ananti. Ananti loses the ball and it goes out. You know, and Ananti there should have used the screen. That way it leaves Kalahan to roll. Yep. Instead, he didn't use the screen at all and left Lahan to be a shooter, which he is not a shooter. So Malaysia is going to get a chance to kick it back in. Ivan Yo has Lahan on him, tries to fake the pass, gets it back to Chi Quen. Chi Quen with a three. In and out. Unable to drop it. That's his second attempt already. He went three for seven yesterday. Zero for two today. Jerome Pan with a nice drive. Draws a foul on Ivan Yo. Very acrobatic take by Apiro Mirai Chai, number 69 for Thailand there. Nice recognition though, this drives in, look, he sees the defender instead of going straight up and getting blocked, decides to go on the other end, draws the foul. Smart, smart play by a smart, smart player. Apiro Mirai Chai unable to make him pay for the foul, misses the first free throw. All right, and he gets his second free throw to go down. Malaysia are in the red with five minutes, 30 seconds left. Thailand actually one foul away from being in the red as well. Both teams got to watch out. Yi Hao back into the court. Nice pass to Quek. Nice pass to Yo. Unable to drop his jump shot. Derong Pan trying to push it, but Malaysia back quickly on defense. Just bad pass there by Derong Pan. Let's see if... Rushed shot. I think no that need. was an attempted pass, but... Yeah, no need to do that. <laughs> because, you know, Kalahan is not so tall, and uh, yeah. it's going to be a tough catch for him. Yeah, and even if he caught it, he was down there all alone against three or four Malaysian players. Not an easy situation to be in. Quick pass it to Yo. Yo to Yi Hao. Yi Hao with a quick shot. Tries to bank it in, doesn't get it. Jerome Pan with another rebound. Pushes the pace up. Chin Chai and Ante, what a layup! And one! What a layup by Chichai Anante. The Malaysia defender thought he had him covered. 
to see that again. Wang Yi how thought he had him defended well. Just reaches it up. Look at that elevation, that extension of his arms. You know, for his size, Chichai Nazi plays well over his size, you know, well over his height, well over his weight. This boy gives up his body, give him a lot of credit. And he drops the free throw as well. The lead is just keeping on growing. It's 37 to 20 now. Malaysia on a bad end of a run. On a 13 to 2 run now by Thailand. Ivan Yo with a floater. Nice shot there. Nice. I, I love that shot right there, you know? Nice Tough shot to guard. Touch. Yeah. Nice soft touch by the big man. That's you... my go-to move, TK. <laughs> We'd love to see you use it soon. And that's Summer Jai. Passes it around. Jerome Pan gets the screen. Nice pass to Chanachon, see, but... See, in that situation, Glahan just needs to do the same thing. Go to the floater. And another foul on Ivan. Yo! And Yo picks up his second foul. The Rompan just smart, just going straight at Ivan Yo after the offensive rebound. In those situations of the offensive rebound, the defending team is not set. You just have to be smart to go straight at it. You just see there. Smart, smart play. Ivan Yo might disagree all he wants, but that was the right call. Clearly a foul. <laughs> Rongpan makes his first four out of five. All right, we got Jason Nook back in. Will Jason Nook be able to continue his hot form? Three out of four in the first quarter. Well, don't matter if it goes down or not. If you're open, you got to let it go. Yep. I'd like to see at least they get him in the first possession, a shooter like this. Got to get him heated early. See what Thailand does on the offensive possession. But here they're on. The defense, Kwan Yung Jing sets up Gan for a long three. Hits the back of the rim. Summer Jai with the rebound. Runs it up. Finds, oh, tries to thread the needle. Tries a little bit too hard. Should have hit Jason Nook in the corner. Yeah, just, <laughs> just saw him in the corner right there. Just waiting. You're up a lot like this. You got you to gotta shoot threes. For sure. Just get that going. You got to get open threes. Collect the rebounds. Kwan Yung Jing trying to face up. Ivan Yo gets not to point to commit. Machi Quen goes straight to the basket. What a move. Unable to finish though, but Ivan Yo rolls in and out. Malaysia still gets the ball. Machi Quen fakes the shot. And a nice little floater. Rolls out. Kwan Yung Jing tries to get the put back. But he fouled by Chana Chon Glahan. That will be his third. Wan Yung Jing's gonna go to the line for two. Nice hustle. Wan Yung Jing, the captain of this Malaysia national team squad. Bit of an awkward shot. Raising his arms up before releasing. A little bit too high. But he makes them both two wow. out of two. That shot. It's un unbelievable. It's, <laughs> it has barely any arc, but he is on the dot. Makes them both. Just proves that sometimes practice really does pay off, despite not having the perfect form. Jerome Pine gets the screen there. Kicks it out. Crosses it to Samurai. High arcing three. Doesn't make it. Swarms Ivan Yo on the rebound. Malaysia breaks out. And a steal by Samurai. I was just waiting. Jerome Pine. Tries to draw the foul, but Malaysia doesn't commit. Missed opportunity. Machi Quen. Gana Samurai gambles there. Gets loose. And the ball still ends up with Malaysia. So Malaysia coming a little bit to life. 24 to 39. Three minutes left in the second quarter. Machi Quen looking for his inbounding options. Has to go all the way to Ivan Yo back there. Gan Hong Hong has Jerome Pan. Kicks it out. Ma. Another attempt. Misses again. Ma not having his best luck from the three point line in this game. Summer Jai. Passing it around. Jerome Pan. Not much movement right now, but Jerome Pan slices. Suk Dave and an offensive rebound. Somehow the ball ends up with Thailand once again. Oh, 
<laughs> Tyson Nope. Another corner three. So that answers our question. Is Nakor Tyson Oak still shooting fire? Yes, he is. He hits another three. That's his 12th point of the game. Pushes the lead to Thailand up to 18, 42, 24. Gan tries to answer, but he doesn't get it to drop. Bandit Lakhan coming in for Jerome Pan Api Romi Light Chai. Two minutes, 10 seconds left in the first half. Just an awesome defensive display by Thailand. Holding Malaysia to only six points in this quarter. Remember, this is a team that scored 84 points on the Philippines. Summer Jai passes it to Suk Dave Gogar. Gogar to Lakan. Summer <laughs> Jai Sinuk. Just passing it around on the perimeter. Nine seconds left on the shot clock. Jai Sinuk once again. Yes, sir. Oh, it is on. Splash. Five of six for Nakar and Jai Sinuk now. Somebody has got to stop him. 15 points. The lead has ballooned to 21. It's 45 to 24. Gotta ask you, Pete, if you're the Philippines on a scale of 1 to 10, how scared are you of this Thailand squad? Hey, I would say about 8. <laughs> Maybe 8.5, DK. Yeah, they're just really impressive. I'm not gonna lie, DK, this Thailand team is looking good right now. Yeah. And, you know, their defense is what scares scares me for other teams. That's true. It's not their offense. It's not yeah. the corner. Jason Oaks shooting. It's just a straight up solid defense. Well, it's the defense that leads to these things. Yeah, true. It's getting the uh, defense of the other team in the back pedal. Jason Nook not forcing it despite having the hot hand. Bandit! <laughs> Sometimes you just gotta laugh that off. Another three-pointer by Thailand. 48 to 24. One minute left in the first half. What a display this has been for Thailand. Yung Jing. Oh, that's a call on a foul. What do you say about that, Pete? Tough luck. <laughs> tough luck. Tough luck. Ban Yung Jing is going to go to the line for two free throws after this timeout. Let's see the slow motion here. And oh. yeah, good, good call. Good call, good call. That's why we're up here and the rest are down there doing their job. They can see it better. Absolutely. So Dave Gogar doesn't believe it, but maybe he will after he sees the replay. <laughs> So after that, Gogar picks up his third foul. Thailand still picking up a lot of fouls, but with a comfortable lead here. Tyson Nook with 15 points, five of six. There we see a layup by Bandit Lakhan. Everyone just contributing. All of the Thailand players right now, except for Chittapontoa Rot has Enter the game. We might be seeing him in the second half. All but four players for Thailand has scored. On the other end, Malaysia. They've gone pretty deep themselves. Played 10 out of 12 players. The main scoring options, though, have been relying on Kwan Yung Jing's six points, Kwek Tin Yuan's eight points, and Ivan Yost's seven points. Wang Yi Hao has not been finishing his shots that he got yesterday, but He's been still getting those motions. He's been, he's been trying to force uh, defenders into those shot fakes. He's only gone one for seven, though. A lot of that, you got to credit the Thailand defense, though. Just impressive. On the floor for Thailand, Summer Chai, Lak Han, Jitta Puntori Road, as we mentioned, now comes in the court. Bati Pan Han and the Korn Nook rounds it out. For Malaysia, there's Teo, Yo, Liu, Yungjing, and Yi Hao. 46 seconds left in the first half. Thailand with possession. Ganat Summer Jai looking around. He has a bigger player on him. Two players committed to Bandit Lakhan and they get the turnover out of it. Thailand on the back pedal. 
that is obviously a traveling violation. Too quick to gather is Teo. Oh, got lucky there. That was, that was clearly a foul. <laughs> <laughs> got lucky. Comfortable lead here by Thailand, 48 to 25, with 27 seconds left in the first half. I think we've pretty much cleared what Thai, uh, what Thailand have been doing well, but let, let's just ask from your perspective, Pete, what do Malaysia have to do coming out of this uh, halftime break? Well, you know, they got to move the ball quicker and they got to pump fake and get perimeter shots. Right now, they're not even getting to shoot mainly and they're shooting these far threes, which are going to be tough. You know, with the, with the fast moving defense like Thailand, you got you to gotta move the ball, get the zone stagnant, and then you gotta you gotta have shot fakes, TK. You gotta have shot fakes, shot fakes. One dribble, pull up. Five sh shot fakes. Go in, handoff. Go up, like the like the floater you saw earlier. Yeah. You know, you, you gotta get shots. That's that's higher percentage shots. Uh huh. And also you gotta get rebounds when Thailand misses, and you gotta outlet pass and run the floor like what they're doing to them. Yes, sir. So you know that's that's all I can really say. Uh, Malaysia's gotta play the what do you call the passing lane better uh -huh. and try to push for the guards to uh, defend their guards better and make them shoot long threes with contests. That's all true. Pete, the stats that have been glaring for Malaysia's struggles, they shot 36% yesterday. Only 18% here today. That's the big, the big difference. And you see now Malaysia's going to a zone. Yeah, they're stepping out. <laughs> if you step in the zone, watch out for that guy right there. Uh, they're sending it up. 11 se 10 seconds left in the shot clock. Takes it down. Nice ball rotation. Kicks it around. Tries to get the open guy. Six seconds left. Throw it rod. Let's one loose. Air balls. And time expires. The first half comes to a close. Thailand is in the lead big. 48 to 25 against Malaysia. This is the fifth Siaba Stankovic Cup held in Thailand. We're going to be taking a short break and we'll be back for the second half.
spectacular. Let's look at the stats here during the halftime break. Malaysia only has one assist. Off of those seven field goals made, only one of seven. As you see there, the field goal shooting percentage only 18.4%. Thailand shooting 37.1%. Turnovers have been pretty equal. Both teams have committed 13. And Thailand still has to watch out for those turnovers. Going up, if, if they're going up against the Philippines, they can't turn, up, uh, turn over the ball frequently like this. The Philippines are going to take advantage of those and uh, convert those into points. But still here in this game, doing pretty well, making those shots. And again, just... Just, just to emphasize one more time is that the swarming defense one. forcing Malaysia to shoot only 18% here. After that halftime show, teams are coming back onto the court to warm up. Let's go through the stats of the players on Thailand. Akorn Jaisanuk, of course, leading the way. 15 points. Leading rebounder. Surprisingly, is the smallest guy on the court. Got not summer Jai with four rebounds. He also leads the team in steals. Bandit Lakhan and Daromhan Apiromli Lai Chai, the second leaders of scoring in Thailand with seven points each. Going to Malaysia, their leading scorer is Kwek Tian Yuan with eight points. The majority of them coming from his free throws. He has been six for eight, just drawing fouls from the Thailand team. He's been fouled three times already. Just trying to get the fans into the mood with the dance cam there. This guy's not shy at all. Shake it, brother. As we mentioned, a pretty good crowd we're having here in Thailand. Looks like we're getting a good age range. Players, uh, people from all ages. <laughs> Women, men, all here. Some people are bringing their children to take in this awesome atmosphere of sports entertainment. Another thing to mention for Malaysia, they have gone 0 for 13 from three-point range. They're going to make a run back into this game. That has got to change. They need to beat Thailand and the Philippines on the way it looks. Yes, sir. Kanatsa Merjai gets the ball, tries to kick it out, but Malaysia anticipating that, and Anandi seems to get a hand in his face, and a water block by Terawatt. That was clearly a foul. And, and a traveling see. violation, Malaysia. And that was clearly a foul. Let's see if we get the slow motion there on Gan trying to drive past Anandi. Anandi still shaking his head on the other side of the court. He was down a moment ago, but he, now he's up. It seems to be no blood. He clearly got pulled there. I don't know about the face, but <laughs> he got pulled down. Yeah, so Gan and Ananti shake hands. No blood drawn. 
But still, Thailand goes away from that possession without losing any points. Good hustle by Tierra to go down for the block. Monster block. Too bad I didn't see that one. I was <laughs> too busy looking at Ananti. Uh, because you care so much, Pete. <laughs> <laughs> nice pass by Summer Jai. Unable to drop it down, but gets the offensive rebound. You always have a way to make me smile. <laughs> okay. oh! He's still going. That car, Jason Oak, has a smile on his face. After he drops his 6-3, that's his 18th point. Thailand up big, 51-25. to Malaysia unable to retaliate at all. Kwan Yun Jing is going to start the offense. Malaysia here. Ivan Yo runs into a stumble. There's a travel there. Machi Quen getting swarmed. Nice pass. Kwan Yun Jing with a soft touch. Drops it down and Malaysia gets on the board to start the third quarter. A lot of credit to Kwan Yu Jing. The only one staying calm and cool-headed right now. And nice find by Machi Quen as well after getting away from the double team. Nice bounce pass. Oh, almost like, a good finish. <laughs> looked like Tier 1 wanted to dunk on him there. Almost a good finish as you mentioned. Doesn't go with the score though. His footing was a little bit off. Otherwise, he would have looked like Blake Griffin just <laughs> now. Blake Griffin, that dunk on the Knicks, wasn't it? He should have, he should have land, he should have landed chest facing him first, <laughs> so he could have went from the left to the right. Maybe we can see it, get that again. But Nagar now taking it to the rim, draws a foul. Quick Tian Yuan. I'm gonna have to teach Nagar to step back on that one. <laughs> That would have been a perfect, easy bump move and a step back. Ananti. Of course, I'm joking there. <laughs> and He's on the national team. I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't go to the tryouts, Pete. <laughs> hey, I'm, I'm glad for these young kids. You know, they're getting, they're getting this kind of venue and this kind of uh, yeah. this sort of exposure too. Nice layup by Ananti. When I was their age, I couldn't find basketball in this country yet. <laughs> so Ananti drops in another two points. Swarming defense here on Ivan Yo. Just now, though I did play high school basketball in America. <laughs> but Ananti looks of disbelief after he gets called for the foul. They're getting too much in the face. Let's see the replays here. Let's see if the call is warranted for. Top call there by the refs. He said he got a hand in the face. Can't completely agree with that. Nazi are such a good slasher for Thailand. That's true. And if you're one step too late, you're <laughs> fouling him for sure because he's... His hands are way up there already. Yeah, and he's not the most heavy guy, so when you hit him a little bit, he's, he's off course, so you're, it's definitely going to be a foul. Yeah. Kwan Yung Jing passes the quick. High shot. Doesn't make it, but he gets his own rebound. Doesn't drop the rebound. It's, but it's not always a disadvantage to be small. Uh -huh. Just got to use it correctly. Absolutely. But Ivan Yo there gets the put back. Lead is 53 to 29. And there is a foul. You know, a la Allen Iverson. <laughs> That's true. Allen Iverson, probably one of the best pound for pound player he ever. He is the best pound for pound ever. 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 <laughs> That's my main guy, Allen Iverson. <laughs> Shanachuk Glahan trying to set it up. Kana Samurai with an explosive drive to the basket. Reverse. Samurai. <laughs> Might have been unnecessary with the double clutch, but drops it down anyways. Gets two down. Thailand still on a roll. Kwan Yung Jing. Kwan Yung Jing with the answer. Nice lefty layup. Drops two more points. Malaysia still trying to stay in this game. 22 point deficit. Samurai. Nice pass to Terawatt. Tries to drive inside, can't absorb the contact. Malaysia on the run. Gun, too strong, but put back by Quek Tian Yuan. And this is what Tim Lewis said they have to have some concern about the offensive rebounding. Malaysia has gotten two baskets to start the half out of that kind of situation. You know, TK, that's a concern, uh, you know, regarding Philippines. They, have, they do really well with the offensive put whack, if that, you know, in the previous game. <laughs> And they're more athletic than Malaysia as well, but Kanat Samurai drops another three, extends the lead even further. More athletic than Thailand as well. Yeah. They're really gonna have to watch out. Samurai drops his seventh point in the game. Gan tries a three, and he hits one this time. The first three for Malaysia in this game. 
might have been a little bit late, but better than ever. Garcia is an oak wide open. How do you leave him open like that? This time it, it works out somehow. Malaysia goes up. Machi Quen. Is there a run coming? Malaysia hits two back to back three pointers. Six and no run. Five minutes, 40 seconds left in the third quarter. Thailand still up by 20, but Malaysia starting to gain steam. Chanachon Kalahan has the ball at the top of the key. Summer Jai runs the pick and roll. Floater rolls in, and another two points. Ganat Summer Jai is coming into his own seven points in this half. Nice try to close the passing lane from Chanachon. Ivan Yo tries a difficult pass, but a foul. and. Rolls off the rim. Quek Tien Yuan can't believe it, but he's going to be going to the line once again. Two more free throws coming up. Nagorn Chai Sanook let that pass go by. Going to see some substitutions. Nagorn Chai Sanook's going to sit down. Apirom Bilai Chai coming in as well as Bandit Lakan. Quack with his first free throw. Misses the front end this time. He's been doing pretty well. Right now, six of nine from the line. Misses that one, however. But makes the second one. Seven for ten for Quack Tin Yuan, the leading scorer. For the Philippi uh, for the Malaysia. With all those games getting a bit confused a little bit. <laughs> Summer Jai brings the ball up. He has Machi Quen on him. Lakan back to Summer Jai aggressively going to the rim. Romi Lai Chai has a taller quick on him. Still goes. Pass to Summer Jai. Drops out on the long end. Ivan Yo fakes a shot, gets it to Gan. Gan. One. You change. Making his presence felt. A three. Third three in the half by Malaysia. You cannot count them out. The lead is down to 18 now. Four minutes and a half left. Romi Lai Chai passes to Lakhan. Thailand now in a bit of a drought. Malaysia is sque squeezing inside and making Thailand shoot long shots. Just forcing, forcing difficult shots out of them. Gan misses the three-point shot there. We're going to have a TV timeout here. So coming out of the timeout, Malaysia down by 18 points to Thailand. It's 60 to 42. Four minutes, 11 seconds left in the third quarter. Malaysia gaining some steam off three pointers from Gan, Ma, and Kwan Yung Jing. However, Ghana Summer Jai has come alive in the second half. Scored seven points already. One three pointer of his own as well. On the court for Malaysia, Kwek Tin Yuan, Gan Hong Hu, Ma Chi Quen, Ivan Yeo, and Kwan Yung Jing. For Thailand, it's the wrong pan Api Romi Lai Chai, Tiro Wat Chan Te Chon, At the Porn Lert Malai Porn, Bandit Lakhan, and Chana Chon Klahan. Bandit calling out the play. Gonna get the wrong pan. Malaysia locking up more on defense. Not giving anything easy. Nice pass by the Rongpan and Chanachon Glahan with a nice put in. 
What a find by the wrong pun. And a good finish as well. Thailand has got to settle down more on defense. There's a call there. Offensive foul seems to be on Kwan Yung Jing. Kwan Yung Jing, that's going to be his third personal foul. Teams have been pretty conservative coming into the second half. Malaysia has only committed three team fouls. Thailand only two compared to the first two quarters where they were in the red early. Sukdev Gogar <laughs> and Ataporn. See, that's an offensive foul on Ataporn, pushing off the defender. Ataporn not liking that. First foul of the game. It's funny there because the ref only sees Ataporn trying to spitter the hand off of his arm, but <laughs> the foul really there is from Malaysia. The foul holding on, Holding on to uh, Ataporn's arm. Machi Quinn gets Ivan Yo. Ivan Yo tries to spin and move inside. Tries a soft touch on the jumper, doesn't drop it down. Ivan Yo started out pretty strong, hitting two jump shots, but since then he's been on and off. Ataporn drives inside, tries to draw the foul. Refs don't buy it. <laughs> it's a turnover. Ataporn not getting the calls his way today. And you know, he's got to stop playing with the refs and play and play ball, you know? But but you have to give it to him. He does have a case there. Ivan Yo's hands did go in a little bit too deep. But as you say, the refs didn't call it. He's got to play on. Yeah, play the game. Don't play the refs. Kwan Yung Jing right in the face of Sukdev Gogar. Get him some burn heal there. <laughs> Sukdev Gogar hasn't been much of a presence on offense. Here's Pati Panglahan. The wrong pine calling for the screen. Looks for the corner. Pati Pine Glahan drives. That's a travel. That's an offensive foul. <laughs> what a call there. Tough call. <laughs> Pati Pine Glahan gives the shrug. I don't know about I don't know about that one. I don't know about the uh, okay, it was a turnover, but I, I would have called the traveling violation. I didn't that didn't seem like I don't know like about an offensive foul on that yeah, one. That I, think didn't, that, I think that's a bad call. He didn't seem to drop dip his shoulder in. But once again the foul the foul is called. Going to play on Thailand up by 18, 62, 44. Kwan Yung Jing doesn't drop the jumper this time. Rong Pan rushing it up. And the steal. Nice anticipation by Ma. Ooh. Nice sidestep too. Ooh, Euro. Drops it in. Malaysia not backing down one bit. And I think uh, Coach Lewis has got to put in shooters right now, you know, to spread the floor. He has no shooters in there whatsoever. Yeah, no offensive rhythm right now. Malaysia has cut the lead down to 16. The only shooter he has in there right now is the point guard. <laughs> and he's got to handle the ball. Exactly. If I was him, I'd go back with Summer Jai, Jai Sanuk, you know, and then you could put uh, Atapon. I would go Kogar and, and probably Tirarut. You know, or, or you need a shooter in there right now because Malaysia is uh, playing inside defense rather than outside defense. Yeah, so. they're just packing it inside, yep. making it hard for guys like Jerome Pan who loves to slice inside to play. And you need you need a, a guard like uh, Summer Jai to go in there and and zigzag and cross over and get to the hole quick. That's true. And he was starting the half strong, but probably needed a breather. Probably we'll see him back in soon. Two minutes left in the third quarter. You know, luckily uh, the the Philippines coaching staff have already left, <laughs> but uh, I'm sure that I've already noticed that uh, Thailand's weaker points are the half court, half court game. The if they run, you know, they're in, they're in their strength. The coaching staff might have left, but I, I'm not doubting that they probably have a scout sitting somewhere, filming this game. <laughs> Dedication of the Philippines scouting team is top notch. Indeed, I agree. So in the floor, we're going to see Bandit Lakhan. Still same lineup. Lakhan, Apiro Mirai Gogar, Lahan, and Lert Malayporn. Oh, there you go. He has uh, Apiro Mirai Chai handling the ball now. Nice. Lati Pank Lahan, though. <laughs> Splash. Well, there's your shooter, Pete. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, Lahan does have that range. He can play a little bit of the three. Coaches like to play him at the four as well. Maybe that can start something. Lead back up to 19. Kwan Yung Jing misses that three-point shot. A 
minute 37 left in the third quarter can malaysia make a dent in the lead once more gogar inbounds to up to romilai chai malaysia has machi quen kwan yung jing ivan yo han Gan Hong Hoong and Quick Tin. You a nice blow by by Bandit Lak Han and he draws a foul. And one. What a blow by by Bandit Lak Han. Gan was looking at the screen. Bandit sensed that and just blew by on the right side all the way to the basket. Hoop and harm. Nice little head fake there by Bandit Lakhan, faking way to the screen and then blowing by to the right. Good sense on the wing. Bandit Lakhan is going to get to the line for one extra free throw. Lakhan sinks. The free throw gets into double digits for Thailand. That's his 10th point. Ban Yung Jing setting up the offense. Nice pass. But he rolls out. Yi Hao. How just unconfident should have went up instantly once he got the ball decided to shot fake to make matters worse he fouls soup Dave Gogar after the defensive rebound Gogar is gonna go to the line for two if you see on the screen there Gogar not only has one of the most flamboyant hairs in the game right now. <laughs> he also has one of the most shockingly colorful shoes. Those Hyper Rev 2015s. Bright green. Doesn't help with his free throw touch, however. <laughs> Misses the front end. Second free throw rims out too, but Attaporn with an offensive rebound. Passes it to Gogar. Gogar gets back to Abirong Chai wide open for three. There is no foul called on Yihao. Gogar puts it back in for two. 70 to 46, Thailand going away once again. The lead is 24. One minute left in the third quarter. Kwan Yun Jing passes it. Trek Tian Yuan stumbles into Gla Han. Gets it down low this time. Goes to its left. The ball rolls out. Quack Tian Yuan shakes his head and says, what else do I have to do to get this ball in? Quack now two for 12 from the floor, but he's been getting a majority of the points. And there's going to be a call there. Seems to be some blood coming from Quack Tian Yuan. He's going to get substituted. No foul there, just refs have to stop the game once he sees blood coming out from any player just to save the situation from getting worse. Batipan inbounding the ball. Gets the ball to alert Malai Porn. Abhiromi Lai almost loses the ball. He has Wang Yi Hao on him. Sukdev Gogar down in the post. Right oh, hook. Good move. But in and out. Such a good move. Really good move. Three point shot. Ha. And three. And the foul as well. See what the foul is. Number 11, Wong Yi Hao foul. Down low on the basket there. Struggling night for the youngster. After a masterful game against the Philippines, he fouls Patipan Glahan on the rebound there. Malaysia does get the, the three-point shot, though, from Gan. Well, you know, TK, the team, the team is not recognizing that, you know, Wang is a really strong offensive player. Nah, they need to help good. him. They need to they get need, him more free. They need to, and then also, if the coach recognizes, they need to get him screens. They need to get him open to let him, you're down almost 30 points. You need to just, you need to have someone who's going to be able to put points on the board. You know, so that's, he, He's not getting the offensive touches yeah. he was getting yesterday. Exactly. Lahan drops two free throws. It's 72 to 48. Last possession here. 10 seconds left in the third quarter. Gan gets the defender to commit. But Yi Hao gets stripped away. Just struggling over and over again. Ref say he loses the ball off his knees. Thailand's going to get the ball with four seconds left. 
see what Bandit Lakhan does. Passes it, and Lakhan <laughs> steps on the line before time expires. Uh, the time just goes out. That's the end of the third quarter. Ten minutes. Let's see what the refs call. He stepped on the line first. I'm going to see if they put a few seconds back on the clock. Okay, the refs are going to put one second back onto the clock. Batipan Glahan stepped onto the line before time expired. So Malaysia ball with one second left in the third quarter. Let's see them resume play. Maybe Malaysia can get something out of this to spark. However... And a long pass, Sukhdev Gogar with the steal. The third quarter officially ends. Point still the same, 72 to 48. Thailand still up huge despite Malaysia's three-point shooting that picked up earlier in the third. Ten minutes left in the game. What do you have to say? What 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 do you think Malaysia can still do in this game, Pete? Well, TK, they just gotta get their head together. And they gotta, they gotta stay in front of their guy first thing. And like I said earlier in the half, they gotta play the passing lane. They're gonna get rebounds. There's so many things they gotta do right now. Thailand is just outplaying them, outsizing them, and out, uh, their experience just is just showing because Malaysia has got a lot of young, young guys here and, and just getting out work right now. You know, so it's a lot to say. Tough to do, TK, when you're down almost 30. Yeah. What a tough schedule Malaysia has had to go through. They started the first game against the Philippines, then picking up the second game against host Thailand. If they lose both of this game, it's going to be hard to come back and get that top two spot. All right, now on the court, they're having some events. Thai fans getting into the fun. This is a weekday. We're having some school kids there. So not only are we getting basketball here at the Stadium 29 in Bangkok, Thailand, we're getting some games between quarters, between the halftime breaks, even before games sometimes. Just a nice event set by the organizers. Fully complete sports entertainment. What a turnaround though, 48 points scored by Malaysia after three quarters. He scored 84 yesterday against the Philippines. Again, credit the defense of Thailand for swarming them over and over and over again. Yeah, great defense by Thailand. By the way Thailand's playing defense, um, I'm really looking forward to seeing uh, Thailand play against the <laughs> Philippines. That's true. But if it goes to that situation, let's, let's say Thailand wins the rest of their games, beats Singapore next. If the Philippines beats the rest of their two games, they'll be playing in their last game against each other before the finals. That's going to be interesting to see what the coaches do. I mean, they're both pretty much locked into the finals. It's going to see if they're going to be playing all of their cards or just reaching each other out to see what they can do. Yeah, definitely. Uh, I'm really, I can't wait to see it. Yeah, but back into the game right now. Fourth quarter started. Malaysia tried to put up the points first, unable to come away. On the floor, Kanat Summer Jai coming back in, along with Badipan Klahan. That's a point alert, Malay Born. Sugave Gogar and Bandit Lakhan. An offensive foul there. Sugdev Gogar, movie screen. That is his fourth personal foul. The ref's quick to the action. On the floor for Malaysia, Ma Chi Quen, Kwan Yung Jing, Wang Yi Hao. I can't see right now, but I'm guessing Quick Tin Yun and Han Gan Hong Hoom. Hey, a lot of credit to these refs. Man. I have to say, I didn't see that until the replay. Yeah, they're picking up a lot of stuff. That's why they're officiating in this level. Juan going to the left again. Nice soft touch, but doesn't roll down. Goes to his right this time, and again out. Wei Hong Chu unable to grab the rebound. Malaysia just unable to drop anything. 
The shooting picked up in the third quarter, but they're still shooting at only 27% throughout the entire game. Thailand, on the other hand, shooting at 43. Bandit Lakhan gets the screen from Tirawat. Finds Glahan in the corner. Glahan with a nice pass to Chandajan. Gets the fake in the air. Nice move by the big man. Solid pass. Solid pump fake. Solid finish. Just solid, solid play from start to finish by Thailand. Nice steal by Chandajan. Almost a steal. Quick hands by Bandit. Still with the ball. Bandit draws another foul on Kwang Yung Jing. Should have gave up the ball quicker. Would have had a layup. <laughs> he had guys on his right there. You see Tirwa Chan to John. That still draws a foul. That's a fourth on Kwan Yung Jing. Once again, a lot of foul trouble for Malaysia. Thailand will drop two free throws. Mandil Lakan misses his first one. Second free throw goes down for Lakhan. We're seeing balanced offense for Thailand once again. Almost everyone, with the exception of Jitapontoero, now has scored. Players are hovering around eight points. Once again, solidifying the, the job that Tim Lewis has been doing. Not focusing on any star player to carry that offense. Even though Nakorn Jaisenok has scored 18 points off six three-pointers. On the other side, Malaysia has been relying on Kwan Yu Jing's 16 points. Quek has 11. Samurai away with the steal. Lahan handles it and Lakhan can bring up the ball himself. Lakhan plays with Patipan Lahan. Tries to find the pass too deep. Nice face-to-face -face defense by Gan Hong Hoon. Malaysia gets the ball. Eight minutes left into the game. At this point, Malaysia has to do something quick and something large. Ivan Yo sizing up the smaller player. Doesn't go straight at him. Quick goes all the way. Oh, Still unable. Quick just looks desperate to get the ball in there and size in desperation. To Portler Milan, nice pass. Three moves and another foul on Quick Tin Yuan. Quick draws his third foul. At the point with a nice drive inside. This quick movement there, Quick. Bad defensive stance. His legs weren't moving, just went the hands, tried to poke it out. Samurai drives inside, nice pass to Chanda John. Chanda John post, nice spin. Overshoots it a little bit. Slipped out of his hands, I think. Yep. Nice pass by Samurai, anyways. Didn't get the points. Malaysia on the back. Kwan Yung Jing going to his left, doesn't drop it this time. Nice tap out by Quek. Gan draws a foul on Lakhan. Lakhan. Lakhan clearly telling the refs good job. Smiling it off. That's only his first personal foul, however. And Malaysia is going to get to inbound the ball from the baseline. Quek steps on the line after the inbound. Malaysia trying to make a case for a foul there. Quek looks away in disbelief. But Mahachi Quen was passing to Quek in a pretty bad situation. Not much room to operate there on the baseline. Shamrachai brings the ball up. He has Mahachi Quen on him. At the porn. Working his way. Drops off. Miscommunication. Passes it to the back of Tiro Wachanda John. And another turnover by Thailand. That is alarming though, the 23rd turnover by Thailand. That is a lot. Just not taking care of the ball that well. But it's still, gonna be a factor when they play Philippines. They gotta true. watch out. And the Philippines do a much better job of pressuring 
Remember how many points Philippines got when uh, from the Malaysian turnovers? Yeah. Just going back onto your point there, just open up the nifty little FIBA live stats. Philippines got 24 points off turnovers over Malaysia yesterday. How many turnovers did Malaysia get? Malaysia got. Malaysia turned the ball 18 times and just doing basic math. Yeah. Thailand's each turn each turnover. Uh, easy way to to think about is each turnover is a point. Yeah. Right now that's already 24, 30 points for Th for Philippines if Thailand still turns the ball over at this rate. Chichayanante back on the floor. He has gone on him and stripped away by Quick. Quick hands. He's trying to break away. Samurjai let, decides to let loose. Quick Tianyue looks to his bench and he says, what did I do wrong? What sins have I committed to receive this? Lahan! What a skying rebound by Tirua Jandajan. Lahan looked like he might have been going for the dunk there. was slipped loose. Santa John flies in for the rebound, drops in another two points. Oh, sorry. Quan Yun Jing still. Yep. still Quan Yun Jing just not giving up. Still carrying the offensive Rebellious. load. Rebellious. Santa John passes it. Ananti, those long arms. Ooh, what, what a layup hook shot. Boy, look, he's just, he just looks like he's climbing the air. <laughs> Quick tries a three. Nothing going right for Quick. Two of 16. The entire game. Just struggling. Quan Yung Jing has 18 points, but it's also taken him 18 shots as well. Not efficient offense from Malaysia. Lead is at 29 points, 5 minutes 21 seconds left, 79 to 50 Thailand in the lead. This is the Siaba Stankovic Cup 2016. Batipan Klahan fakes a shot in the corner, tries to drive inside, Kwan Yung Jing drops to the floor, tried to draw a charge. The ball is tapped out by Thailand. Patipan drove in a little bit too awkwardly, wasn't able to get the foul. You have to hand it out for the Thai basketball fans despite this huge lead. They're still all here. They're still all cheering. It ain't over until the fat lady sings. Well, maybe we can bring a fat lady onto the half court after the game. That would be a sight to see. That would be... Anyone you're thinking of in particular? <laughs> uh, not yet. <laughs> <laughs> Quick Tian Yuan rolls the ball down. Saving some time. Ma Chi Quen. Do you have a fat lady in mind, TK? <laughs> <laughs> going back to the topic. Let's go back to basketball. Let's go back to basketball. For now. Quan Yung Jing sets up Chu Wei Hong. Splash. I haven't said that for a minute. <laughs> Team's not dropping those threes, but there Malaysia draws one in. Chu Wei Hong gets his first point of the game. Puts Malaysia back within 26. Still a pretty big lead, but if they drop enough consecutive threes, might be still a game. Balipan Klahan drives inside, draws a foul on Chu Wei Hong. Klahan, uh, number 36, is still a pretty young, uh, inexperienced player, not realizing how tall he really is. <laughs> How tall and how long and yeah his leaping ability is not that bad yeah i mean he, he's already inside the paint he should just attempt just need someone to point out his potential yeah maybe this tournament will be it you're coming off a curl you get the ball you're six foot seven if i was him <laughs> go i'm straight. going from the dunk from the free throw line <laughs> just foul me if you do <laughs> i'm going from the dunk from the free throw line tk <laughs> Hey.
4 minutes 36 seconds left. Thailand still up huge. 79 to 53. Still plenty of fans. Filling out the stadium 29 today. Coaches of Thailand have got to be pretty pleased with what they're seeing. Coach Tim Lewis, assistant coaches Bia Pongpirun and Ratne Kurtiwa. Both also ex-national team players. Got to be impressed with what their juniors are doing on this team. Thailand's going to inbound the ball on the court for them. Ananti, Glahan, Tirawat, Kanat Samarjai, and Ataporn Lerma Porn. And Malai Porn tries a pretty difficult pass, turns the ball over once again. Fumbles into the stands. And one of our courtside fans almost gets on the wrong ends of a collision. It almost gets a personal handshake. <laughs> and that's why you pay for those seats. <laughs> Just for the chance of that. Machi Quen saving some time. Gets the ball up. He's on the floor with Quan Yung Jing. Gan Hong Hoong. Chu Wei Hong doesn't drop the three. And Quick Tian Yuan. Thailand gets the rebound once again. Summer Chai bringing the ball up. Tries to get inside. What a move. Doesn't get the layup though, but almost. Quick with the rebound. Pushes up. Machi Quen gets it to. Juan Yung Jing leads with his hands. Lefty rolls oh. it in. <laughs> that, Amazing. That left hand by Quan Yung Jing. He's now at 20 points. Doing everything to keep Malaysia within this game. It's 79 to 55. Lord Malai Porn wide open. Doesn't take the shot though. Ananti gets it to Samurai. Thailand just moving. Klahan fake the shot there. Fake to me too, but moves it to Lord Malai Porn. Nice rebound by. Tirawat Chandrajan doing a lot on that offensive board. Ananti drives to the left, crosses it back. Five seconds left on the shot clock. Does Lert Malaypur know this? He puts it. Draws a foul. Quick Tian Yuan looks surprised, but mm -hmm. the refs called it. In that possession there, TK, you know, the ball is getting stuck. Malaysia is trying to force Thailand to penetrate. And this is the situation where I wonder, you know, why I think Jai Sanuk should, should be in there. That's true. Or maybe at this point, it's a pretty big lead in the tail end of the fourth quarter. You have a shooter like Chitabon Thoirod who hasn't really got much minutes. Yeah. Maybe bring him in, maybe get him yeah. going. They still have a That's lot a, of more games playing left. That's a really good point, DJ. Yeah. Really good. I, I forgot about him, actually. <laughs> Let's see if Coach Tim Lewis indeed puts him back into the game. Going into the timeout here. Three minutes, 17 seconds left in the game. Thailand still up huge. Tirawa Chandajarn doing his damage on the offensive board. Four, I repeat, four offensive rebounds. That is a lot because you get that many much more chances or opportunities to create points has just been disruptive. Malaysia not doing a good job rebounding. 13 defensive rebounds for the Malaysian squad. That's even less than Thailand's offensive rebounding, which means that for every shot that Thailand has missed, it's almost 50% that they're going to get another shot at it. Ataporn going to the line for two after that foul from Quick. Quick has picked up his fourth foul. Ataporn misses the front end. And there we go. We have Jitaponto Road on the court, Pete. All right. It's as if Tim Lewis can hear us from up here. <laughs> And Ataporn Lord Malayporn drops the second free throw. The score for Thailand is 80 to 55. Three minutes, 15 seconds left. Wan Yung Jing still trying to will his Malaysian squad back into the game. Ma Chi Quen 
splash there. Ah. I'm just going to say that for you this time. <laughs> Put on the line, though. But they counted as three, though. Seemed a little bit foot on the line, but they count three for Malaysia, 58 to 80. Jitapunto Road playing the point. Not his usual position, but Coach Tim Lewis has practiced him well here. Tries to go deep in. Nice pass! Done to John with another two. What a find by Jitapunto Road. Malaysia trying to set it up once again. Goes down low to Quek Tin Yuan. He has Atapuran on him. Gan drives inside. Kicks it out to Quan Yung Jing. Unable to get the roll. Thailand still with the ball. Two minutes, 23 seconds left. Kicks it out to the corner. Chitapuran drives inside. Turnover. Malaysia on the run, but Atapuran trying to tap it out. He's got to watch out. Nice pass by Ma. That's a smart pass there. That, that's a smart play. Had the defender trailing him, saw his teammate, passed it off, unselfish. Atapan has been playing for quite a long time here. Nah, that's pretty interesting how Tim Lewis has been keeping him in. Batipan Galahan, corner three, doesn't make it. Interesting how long Atapan has been playing and how long the Korn Chai Sinok has been sitting. Chu Wei Hong drives inside, doesn't get the foul. Chitapan Toe Rot. Slows it down, looks for the options. Nice pass to Glahan. Nice long layup, but doesn't get it. John to John with another offensive board. Just keeping that offense going. Thailand. Jitapon Towe Road from the corner. Say it, Pete. Splash. <laughs> Just keeping that going. 85 to 60. One minute left. Thailand is not stopping easily. Malaysia not giving up, still playing hard. Good pass from Kwan Yung Jing, but that's just the problem for Malaysia. That's a tough rim for Malaysia on that side. I've seen a lot of that unforgiving rim tonight here. In and out. All right. Malaysia gets the first free throw to go down. The rim is forgiving after all. And Malaysia gets the second one to go down. Duran Pan to Tirawat. Tirawat goes at it himself. No good. Malaysia fronts it forward. Gets an easy layup. 85-64, 21 point lead. Seven Thailand to 69, to 65. A little bit of contact. No foul called, Malaysia's running. Good defense by Thailand, but Malaysia still has possession. And a timeout for Malaysia. Don't forget to stay tuned tomorrow, ladies and gentlemen. Tomorrow, the first match starts 4 p.m. local time here in Bangkok as Indonesia goes against Singapore. And for our doubleheader, as our second game, 6.30, Malay, excuse me, uh, first match, 4 p.m. as Singapore versus Philippines, and doubleheader, Indonesia versus Malaysia for the second game at 6.30, here at Stadium 29, you're watching the Siabas Stankovic Cup 2016.
All right, and we're back from timeout. Malaysia's got the ball. Inbounds it in. Number eight fakes a three, gets a floater to go up. No good. And Tier what comes up with the rebound. Deron Pan. Back to seven for uh, Thailand. Gets the ball stolen and an easy layup for Malaysia. Eighty-five, sixty-six. Nine seconds left in the game. Out the pawn from the corner. No good. And that's a game, ladies and gentlemen. Today, Thailand gets the better of Malaysia here at Siba Stankovic Cup 2016. The final score is 85 to 66. Thailand takes it. Stay tuned for the stats here. And also we have the courtside reporting with my uh, partner TK as he will be interviewing Thailand's head coach, Tim Lewis.
เรา3 0 6ครับฟิลโก28ต่อ39เทอร์โนเวอร์28ต่อ21ครับบล็อก3ต่อ2โอ้โหเทอร์โนเวอร์เราเยอะเราเยอะอาจจะมองว่าเยอะแต่ว่ามาดูว่าควอเตอร์สุดท้ายเราค่อนข้างจะปล่อยใช่ก็ทําให้เสียการเทอร์โนเวอร์เทอร์โนเวอร์หลายครั้งหน่อยนะครับดูดิเฟนซีฟดีบาวครับเราเก็บได้ครึ่งหนึ่งเลยนะครับ30ต่อ16ครับโดยเฉพาะไม่ใช่แค่เซ็นเตอร์ครับที่รีบาวนะครับมีกาดอย่างการนัดใช่ไหมฮะมีอย่างปฏิพานนี่ก็ไปช่วยรีบาวได้หลายต่อหลายครั้งครับก็วันนี้เป็นแมชที่ดีครับสำหรับทีมชาติไทยชนะ2นัดรวดนะครับแล้วสกอร์ที่ทําได้ก็ใกล้เคียงแมชแรก89แมชนี้ที่85ครับก็ตอนนี้ขึ้นเป็นทีมนําแล้วล่ะเพราะว่าเราชนะมา2นัดส่วนมาเลเซียนั้นแพ้2นัดเท่ากับอินโดนีเซียครับสิงคโปร์กับฟิลิปปินส์ชนะมาอย่างทีมละ1นัดครับก็ตอนนี้เดี๋ยวโยนไปที่ในสนามนะครับที่ทีกรพร้อมที่จะสัมภาษณ์โค้ชหลังจากจบการแข่งขันครับสวัสดีครับก็มากับเกมจบไปแล้วนะครับสำหรับเกมของระหว่างทีมชาติไทยกับทีมชาติมาเลเซียนะครับซึ่งทีมชาติไทยชนะไป85ต่อ66ต่อไปนี้เราก็จะมาถามความรู้สึกของทีมชาติไทยนะครับเริ่มต้นจากโค้ชของทีมกับโค้ชทีมนะครับ uh, so how impressed are you with the form of the Thai national team right now I mean I'm really impressed I think they've uh, we've come a long way from three weeks ago four weeks ago and uh, You know they I, they're playing some really good basketball. They've embraced what we're trying to do, um, and you know we keep getting better every time we play a game. So, are you pleased with the form right now? Yeah, I'm really pleased. I mean, you can always want more. We had too many turnovers tonight, 28 of them. But at the other end of the floor, we out rebounded them. Um, so you know that we just got to keep improving. There's always going to be areas of weakness. I'm happy though. I mean, these guys deserve what you know. They've been practicing hard twice a day, and and this is the result of everything. So. ครับผมสำหรับโค้ชทีมก็บอกว่าเขาภูมิเขาภูมิใจกับฟอร์มของทีมตอนนี้มากมาไกลจริงๆหลังจากที่ซ้อมมาร่วม3อาทิตย์ที่ผ่านมาแล้วก็ถึงแม้จะมีเรื่องที่ต้องปรับปรุงเช่นเทอร์โนเวอร์หรือรีบาวแต่ก็ถือว่าพอใจกับฟอร์มครับและต่อไปเราก็จะมาคุยกับผู้เล่นที่ถือว่ามีฟอร์มฮอตมากวันนี้ทําไปทั้งหมด18แต้มยิง3แต้มลงไป6ลูกก็อยากจะถามคุณรังนักกรใจสนุกหน่อยนะครับว่ามีอะไรที่บันดาลใจให้วันนี้ยิงแม่นขึ้นมาหรือเปล่าครับก็เริ่มจากการฝึกซ้อมครับจากเพื่อนร่วมทีมที่ดําเนินตามแผนสวนกลับป้องช่วยกันป้องกันอะไรอย่างนี้ครับแล้วก็กลับไปเกมบุกเซตเพย์ได้สวยงามครับแล้วทีนี้ก็จะเหลืออีก2เกมในรอบแรกนะครับคิดว่าทีมชาติไทยจะสามารถรักษาฟอร์มแบบนี้ได้หรือเปล่าครับก็ต้องพัฒนากันต่อไปครับดูผู้ต่อสู้ดูเกมลุกเกมรับของผู้ต่อสู้ครับแล้วก็ช่วยกันแก้ไขรายละเอียดต่างๆครับครับนั่นก็คือความเห็นของทีมชาติไทยหลังจากที่ชนะทีมชาติมาเลเซียไป85ต่อ66นะครับก็เป็นชัยชนะที่ถือว่าทําให้ตอนนี้ทีมชาติไทยเป็นชนะ2แพ้ศูนย์แล้วนะครับแล้วก็จบกันเพียงเท่านี้สําหรับซีบาสแตนกูวิชครับ2016แล้วเดี๋ยวไว้เจอกันใหม่ครับก็จบไปแล้วนะครับสำหรับแมชที่2ของทีมชาติไทยเรารนะครับในศึกซีบาสแตนกูสครับ2016ครั้งที่5ครับก็ต้องขอบคุณคุณผู้ชมครับที่ติดตามติดตามรับชมนะครับไม่ว่าจะเป็นช่องทางทางโมโนทีมตินาแล้วก็โมโนพลัสนะครับพรุ่งนี้ก็ยังมีการแข่งขันต่อเนื่องนะครับเป็นแมชที่ทีมชาติไทยจะไม่ได้ลงได้พัก1วันนะครับแต่ว่าเกมการแข่งขันก็ยังเข้มข้นครับโดยเฉพาะคู่แรกสิงคโปร์กับฟิลิปปินส์ในเวลา16นาฬิกานะครับก็ยังมีความหมายด้วยกันทั้งคู่ต้องการชัยชนะในนัดที่2ด้วยกันทั้งคู่เลยครับก็นั่นก็คือทั้งหมดในการถ่ายทอดสดในวันนี้นะครับก็ถือว่าวันนี้ทีมชาติไทยเราทําได้ดีตามเป้าแล้วก็มอบความสุขให้กับแฟนบาสเกตบอลชาวไทยนะครับ,รบขอบคุณทางการถ่ายทอดสดด้วยนะครับทั้งทีบอร์ดแบรนด์นะครับที่ร่วมในการถ่ายทอดนะครับเช่นเดียวกับ n t h a i c o m อ่าดอและก็โมโนกรุ๊ปนะครับขอบคุณสถานที่จัดการแข่งขันนะครับสเตเดียมทเวนตี้นนะครับสนามบาสเกตบอลแห่งใหม่มาตรฐานระดับสากลบนถนนชัยพฤกษ์นะครับจัดการแข่งขันโดยบริษัทโมโนสปอร์ตจำกัดร่วมกับสมาคมกีฬาบาสเกตบอลแห่งประเทศไทยและดำเนินการถ่ายทอดสดโดยบริษัทโมโนบอสแคสจำกัดครับส่วนนี้เวลาการถ่ายทอดสดหมดแล้วนะครับเราสองคนนะครับพร้อมทีมงานต้องขอลาไปก่อนครับไปไหนพรุ่งนี้ครับสวัสดีครับ